Hello, and again, welcome to Epic Stencil Tutorials. Uh, today, by popular demand, we will be blowing up a random city in Stencil Works, the best creator. Uh, so we're, we're going we're gonna to start that by making a new game. And we're going to call it uh, Nuke. Okay, now the first thing we want in this missile game is a missile actor. So we're going to go over the actor section and make a new actor called Missile. And uh, it's going to need going to need a missile animation. So, uh, okay, and now we are going to make sure it has a collision found. Okay, now now we're gonna go over to physics and make sure it can fall properly by ensuring that it is affected by gravity and also can rotate because missiles sometimes do that. <laughs> now, now we're going to want to make our city graphic actor that blows up by the missile. We're gonna call this. We're we're we're, we're gonna t call this city actor. Is, um, Manhattan. And we're we're gonna give this city a graphic. Something that looks like Manhattan. Manhattan is a common place of destruction in media. Um, I need to make I need to make a graphic for Manhattan real quick. I, uh, just guide them through making a graphic in Photoshop. In Photoshop, you're gonna want to take the pencil tool, and draw a city that looks like Manhattan. Manhattan has many tall buildings and smog Whoops. and mean people. So once you've drawn all those aspects, you should have something that looks like Manhattan. And also be sure to color it. What color? I don't know, Manhattan color. Uh, <clears throat> we'll just color the sky blue and include some shades of red in there. Um, we'll just go ahead and add a pretty little tree, little tree in the corner. Because they have trees on the sidewalk sometimes. <clears throat> okay, it's color. Okay, now that we have our city graphic, we're, we're going to want to put in an animation for the city using that city graphic. So that the city looks like that. Now we're going to go over and uh, we're, we're going to make behaviors now. The, the best part of Stenzel. This is where the magic happens. It's very, very casual. Very easy to make these behaviors. Uh, the categories. Well, we're going to start by making a missile. Wait, no. Missiles don't need behaviors. We're going to start by making a, a city behavior so that when it is hit by a missile, it blows up. And also yields explosive bits so it doesn't just disappear. Choose a category. To, category. category. Choose. to do this... Hold on, it wants me to update Adobe Air. Come on. <laughs> okay, go on. What the hell's Adobe this. Air? What, what, oh, hold on, what is Adobe Air? What is Adobe Air? And when did I install it? What the hell? Keep going. <laughs> To make this blow up behavior, you're gonna want to start with the always block because well, Manhattan always hold blows on. up. We, let me do, let me just create the behavior. Okay. We'll, we'll call it blow up. Okay. <clears throat> okay, we're in design mode. Okay. Let's start with <laughs> the always block, and then we're going to um, no no no, start with the collision block. Yes. If this 
you're going to want to get the the collision category and then you're going to want to make sure that if it was hit on the top then it dies but before it dies it yields a bunch of bacon i mean <laughs> it's a bunch <laughs> of exploding bits okay well blah, blah means we're gonna have some bacon that, um it's gonna explode bacon Manhattan. <clears throat> Continue, Winsenheimer. Oh, um... I mean Blob. We... No, 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 oh, not, okay. not you, Winsenheimer. Blob. <clears throat> um, so once this behavior is set to die when a crystal hits it on top, we're gonna want to and, it yield, bacon, right? and it yields bacon. I mean, exploding we to, bits. We, we need to create a bacon actor. <clears throat> we need to create a bacon actor. We didn't create the bacon actor, Blob. <laughs> Jeez, Blob. Give the program. Blob, guide them through the steps to create a bacon actor. <laughs> Jesus, man. Blob. Oh, oh, bacon. One, right. Two. Bacon is a common product of turkeys, so you're going to want to give it a turkey shape silhouette. Talk about creating the actor. We have the graphic. Oh. <laughs> What's wrong with you, man? We're, okay, we're just we're just gonna we're just gonna fly through this. They know what to do. Okay, gravity. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. Collision. Okay. okay hold on. Uh, everything's going wrong. <laughs> Make sure that actors glide with each other. And once you've got all the behavior properties, it's time to start making your scene. We we need to create the bacon flying effect. Okay, what you're gonna want to do <laughs> is under the when created block, is set when created. Naked. What? Under the when created block that, because it's gonna. That's not a when created block. There's a created block. Just create, and then... The when created. What? When created, the general ball. There's a when created? When created, the oh, starting Oh, Jesus point. Christ, it's late. Okay. <laughs> Continue. <laughs> okay. Then you're gonna want it, so it flies to the right or left. What happens? Uh... Uh, you're gonna want to make attributes. These are a unique feature to stencil work. Hold on, what the hell's going on? We didn't even. What happened to the bacon? This is the bacon beha behavior, yes. This is the blow up behavior. What the heck? Oh. <laughs> okay, so when this when this collides, if the top was hit, yep. then create four bacon's around it uh -huh. at. Create four bacons at X of self and Y of self, mm -hmm. and then kill itself. Yeah, I know. We'll we'll, we'll make the bacon fly. All right, we'll make. Okay, make it. Okay, make yeah. Set set X speed to fifty for last created actor, and make it create a bacon every one second. Okay. Use the random number generator to gen generate a random speed between 1 and 50. 4x speed. So it will set the x speed randomly for the last created actor, or in this case, the bacon. Okay, we're going to do it four times. We're going to make four bacons. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. This creates the ultimate in random bacon. <laughs> How are we gonna take ourselves seriously after this? What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> 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 this
this will yield a very realistic effect <laughs> from bacon flying. Oh, jeez. <clears throat> okay. I think everything's good. So, has, it, has this behavior been made? Okay, we want to we attach that behavior to Big Manhattan. <laughs> um, um, now we put the Manhattan behavior in a newly created scene, which we'll call, uh, Mountain. <laughs> what? What the fuck? Okay. <clears throat> okay. And once we have created the mountain scene, we're going to place Manhattan... <laughs> And we're going to place some missiles above it. We have the missile actor, yes. Like, how many missiles? Like, 20. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's... Um, wait. Hold on. I got... Okay, we have, like, 7 or something. Or Yeah, that's 20. That's 20. Okay, now we want to set gravity to... to 100 down... Are we missing any behaviors? I don't think Assistant so. No, I don't think so. We got it. Okay, now we're going to need a tile set. So we can, we can go to Stencil Forge and download one of Blob's various tile sets of grand quality. <clears throat> what? <clears throat> I don't understand. We'll download colorful blocks. We'll, we'll download colorful blocks. Then we'll put them in the scene. Speak of putting them in the scene. What? Speak of putting them in the scene. We'll put them in the seed. And so the scene's all set up, yes? Now we've crafted a masterful scene in which the city of Manhattan blows up by descending missiles and creates... Sporadic bacon effect. Hit the launch button, Corey. No, uh, lift off. And as you should have just witnessed, we successfully crafted a very good game in Stencilworks. So, so try Stencilworks today.